Am I mad? You already said that. Oh, I did. Uh, I just wanted you to remember the name. That's why. Yeah. Yeah. And so you called me here? Oh, I did? Seriously, I did? Oh. Oh, yeah, so it's, yeah, 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 for real. I called you, yeah, I did. <laughs> Why did I forget? I, I called you, yeah. I did call you. Yeah. What is it you want to discuss with me? Um. Uh, Hello? I'm so sorry, dear. Please, can we go someplace private? Here is kind of a bit crowded. I really would love to talk to you in a cool place. And maybe with some drinks, please. Ahmed, or whatever you call yourself. Yeah. And so because you want to ask me out, you called me all the way here to be asked out by a guy who cannot look the girl to her face and ask her out. And instead of walking up to me yourself, you sent that... that puppet of yours to do that for you, isn't it? Dude, you are such an amateur. And I am sorry, I do not do amateurs. Oh, please, don't like this. How did it go? Best I screwed up. <laughs> Don't tell me it was your attitude. My attitude? Do I have attitude? Yes, of course. You have serious attitude. And how come you haven't mentioned that to me before? Because of this. Your attitude. Well, whatever. Listen, I know I have an uncontrollable attitude, but I cannot help it, especially when someone is being a weakling. Bess, can you imagine? He couldn't even look me in the face to tell me what he wants to say. Then leave him. What? Yes. It's obvious he can't handle you and frankly, he's not your type. So leave him. But I can't, Bess. In fact, his soft, shy nature makes me love him the more. Wow. Bess. 